Hello YouTube, this is Bowtie Media. Today we've got a reaction of the brand new mega collab, not really triple collab, of Rival Fairlane and Philip Strand, even though he's more of a vocal feature on this track. I'll still technically call it a triple collab. Oblivion, new dubstep track out of Monster Cat Uncaged. I am very intrigued to see what this song is going to be like. Uh, also, big fan of the artwork. It's a very different style for Monster Cat, and uh, I, I, I think it works. I think it works, especially in if there's more of a storyline to it, or if there's similar artworks that were to go along to alongside it. It's a very different direction for Monster Cat as a whole, and uh, I'm actually for it. I'm, I'm all for it. So props to the artist there. I don't know who that was, but uh, without any further ado, let's not prolong it. Let's hop into this track and review in some extent. Uh, here is Oblivion by Rival Fairlane and Philip Strand. I just don't want this to be basic mellow dub. That's all I ask. Not basic mellow dub. We'll see how that goes. We're going through the rabbit hole like a million times before. We're always tipping on our toes without an antidote. You got me high on feelings. You're always rushing through my veins. You're from my head down to my core. We're coming off the ground. We're never coming down. So will you take my hand and leap of faith into a place? Whoa. Okay. Whoa. It's not basic mellow dub, so and okay. Okay. Very intrigued. How could something beautiful turn into something beautiful? Got me high on feelings. You're always rushing through my veins. So from my head down to my core. Coming off the ground. We're never coming down. So will you take? Wow, okay. Rival Fairlane, Philip Strand, Oblivion. Uh, so, in the song that came out uh, earlier this week on Monster Cat Uncaged, I said that uh, 505 uh, was my favorite Uncaged song of the year. And uh, this isn't my favorite song of the year, this one isn't it, but this is number two. I'll say this is number two. Uh, this is my second favorite Uncaged song of the year. Uh, my gosh. I, uh, I, I don't know. That was, that was really good. I, maybe I've just been so attuned to the, um, 
the boring monotonous of basic mellow dub nowadays that I'm hearing this. I'm like, wow, this is actually killer. Uh, so I'm not sure if I'm just so used to hearing all that other mellow dub and I'm like, yo, something different. And this is, this is like blows me away. And this is actually just average, but, uh, <laughs> I really like this. I was a huge fan of it. Uh, the biggest thing I actually liked about this track, uh, Philip Strand, uh, his vocals, um, his, his inflection, his, uh, I don't even know what's the right word. Um, his tone, he, he, he has a lot more, he's often comes in and just does like these kind of like screamy stuff. And he does like, he gets a little loud here, but, uh, he's a little bit more reserved on it. And I think it's, uh, it's increasing like the, I don't know, the quality of his voice, the, um, the, the more sentiment behind it. Uh, they gave him a lot more time at the beginning of the track to really explore where it was kind of just talking about him. It was just like his style his vocal was going over a, just kind of a basic backing track and it wasn't, it wasn't, uh, what's a bit, okay, here's the best way to put it. So normally his tracks or the songs that he's on or part of, he like compliments those tracks well and it's not the, he's not the focus of the track. And I think not, it wasn't the focus of this track, but I think it, uh, he was, he like, they like did like a baton pass halfway through the song where it kind of like, he was the main focus and then it kind of, the production really stood out a little bit more and then it kind of did a little back and forth and so... I was a fan. I was a fan. I also haven't listened to Rival before. I don't think I've heard anything of theirs uh, beforehand. I'm just looking through their Spotify stuff. I don't think there's anything I've really listened before. Um, so maybe I'll have to go give Rival a listen uh, because, I mean, Fairlane does a lot of different variety of stuff. Um, so I could hear some of the Fairlane influences here, but uh, that may be a lot more Rival. So I'm not sure, but uh, way to go. Way to go. Uncaged killed it this week. Uncaged killed the he killed it this week. Uh, but what do you guys think of this triple collab of Oblivion? Let me know in the comment section below. And with that, I've been Bowtie Media, and I will see you guys in another video.